Hello fellow YouTubers, Scott here from Scott Mechanics UK. Just going to do a quick glow plug test on this 2 litre diesel using the power probe hook and a test light. So I'll show you what's meant to happen and then what's actually happening. First of all, we'll connect up the power probe hook. And we'll test light to battery negative. Just test light on the battery negative. This is our power probe hook. Light on there for now, like so. Right. Right, with the power probe, turn the speaker off. Just zoom into that. Okay, we turn the speaker off. And what we'll do, we'll turn it to 65 amps. And then we'll put the the switch inside of it onto a pulse. Okay. Now going to power probe plus mode. This will show the current draw on a glow plug. So do we have a Let's focus in on it? We have a glow plug, connect the glow plug one side of it to earth as it would be fitted on the car. The other side of it, and, uh, put the pulse through it. If you look, we'll do this test light. You can see the test light pulsing off and on, and the current draw is 14 milliamps. Now watch what happens when we do the same test to a glow plug. There's our glow plug. Touch the end of it. See 14 amps. 13. 11. 10. 9 amps. Starting to glow nicely now. 8 amps, 7 amps, 7.5 and, and we're staying around 7.5 amps with it glowing nicely. So that shows you it working with a good one. Now we'll take one that doesn't work. A bad one. Here we have a bad one. So we'll touch this. Earth it like it would be fitted to the car. As you can see the red light's still flashing, showing we're getting a pulse going to the power probe. We'll just make sure it is by testing our test. And you can see we have a nice pulse still. So we'll take our pad one and touch it. As you can see, you get nothing. Pulsing away, zero amps, no current draw on a bad one at all. So, with that in mind, if we try the glow plugs on this car now, and I touch the rail. We just touch the rail like so. 
is on the glow plug rail and you can see nothing at all no draw whatsoever now just to prove a point here if we touch the rail with our test light you see 14 amps of pulse going through it yeah we'll do let's see if we can touch one a bit closer in there there you go see the test light flashing and 14 amps milliamps if we take that off absolutely nothing shows the glow plugs are no good thank you for watching